Here's ten things you need to know about Marta Rosler. The New Yorker, born and raised in New York, and beginning as an artist during sixty, time of civil rights, feminist movement, war, and pop culture, Rosler's work is shaped by this Americanization of her dark family. In her interview with New York Times, Lala said her sense of justice might form her background religion, which is orthodox. Marta is an early feminist artist. We can see that most of her work contains women as the main character. She was interested in representing the way women were shown in magazines and newspapers. The series Body Beautiful or Beauty Knows No Pain got lots of influence from the women's movement that happened during 1960 in America. She talks about pressure, expectation, and fantasy upon women. This series contains image of women showing up like a product for consumption. She first trained as an abstract painter before knowing pop art. After that, she got lots of inspiration from it, and it became one of her signatures such as news, magazines, and home decoration. Photo montage style, her signature collage has been combining day-to-day -day life with serious issues. Makeup hands up, this piece presenting many aspects of society, war, privilege, race, sex, gender role, and ethnicity. She also creates installation, sculpture, performance, and digital media. All of this still involve with femininity, such as the work Semiotics of the Kitchen, which shows us a housewife who is discontented about oppressive women's role. Food In the art installation named A Gourmet Experience, Lossler shows food to represent the concept of American imperialism. Lossler believes that the dinner table never isolated from global hierarchies. An anti-war in Home Beautiful Bringing the War House, a series of photo montage depicting contrasting of Vietnam War and American Dream House from Life magazine to emphasize the literary concept of domestic safety and gender role. Look, this is easy. You can do this too. This is a message that she used to encourage the young artists and other people.